Hey guys, um, so I'm going to first off apologize um, if my voice sounds a little off. Um, <clears throat> I have a really bad cold or something and my voice is kind of in and out and it comes, it goes, it doesn't want to stay, it gets raspy, it gets froggy, it sounds like Mickey Mouse or Minnie Mouse. <clears throat> Either way, I... I wanted to come on and I wanted to make a video um, and just kind of talk to you guys for a little bit. Tell you kind of maybe a little bit of an update. Um, I don't know, just kind of let you guys know what's going on in the life of me. Um, so people are buying a lot of the Peace and Love pendants and um, I think there is... I don't know exactly off the top of my head how many we have left, but there is still more if you're interested in buying them. They're twenty dollars, um, and I'll put the link down below. Um, and um, yeah, so it's getting closer to the Ellen show, and um, I'm thinking and I'm hoping that we might actually make it and um we probably will be able to go and um when i do get there if we get there um i'm going to make a video lots of videos and lots of pictures and show you guys how it is in california and just how awesome and you know show you as much as i can that will be allowed in the ellen show you can't actually bring your camera in there <clears throat> because you're not allowed to um, but you can like take pictures in the studio, but not actually in the studio where she is. Um, so I will do that. And, um, you know, I think it's going to be a really, really cool experience. I'm really excited about it. I'm just hoping that we'll be able to sell some more of the pendants and, um, <clears throat> you know, this way we'll have a little extra money and stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> My, my, I'm losing my voice. I wanted to talk about a topic today um, that people have been asking me to talk about. I've been putting it off because I guess it's kind of an awkward topic, I guess. Um, it is about your first sexual experience. And it doesn't... I'm And when I say that, I don't mean just like, you know, your first gay experience or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> whether you're straight, you're bi, you're gay, whatever gender, whatever, you know, your sexual orientation is, I'm doing a video right now on your first time experience, your first sexual experience, and I guess in a way it's a little embarrassing, which I don't really care, you guys know me, I for the most part talk about anything, whether it's embarrassing or not. Um, I'm an open book. I answer pretty much anything you ask me. And, um, you know, that's just, that's how I am. Um, I believe the more experiences you make, the better. For anything, not just, like, you know, sexual experiences. But, um, all life is an experiment. Everything in life is an, ex is an experiment. So, um... <clears throat> I think that with that being said I want to know your first time experiment experiences with um, your sexual encounters so mine um, I had sex with one guy and um, the first time I had sex with a girl and I know right away you guys are like, oh my god, you are so young, how do you know, blah, blah, blah. But I do know. Um, my first, I guess, quote-unquote sexual experience with a girl was when I was 13 years old. Um, I know that seems really, really young, but I was 13. And no, it wasn't like the full-blown, like, having sex, but <clears throat> it was... I don't know, it was... Um, interesting. I mean, it was different. I obviously liked it, 
I wasn't really sure why I did because I was only 13 and I'm like, well, in my head I figured, well, I'm supposed to be with a boy, you know, and here I was with a girl. So I guess in a way it's a little weird, you know. Um, but I was with a girl when I was 13 and then I actually had my virginity taken from a guy um, when I was 17. So I lost my virginity when I was 17 to a guy. And just one guy, same guy, had sex with him two times. And, um, I, I don't know, it, it didn't do anything for me, hence why I think I knew back then, too, that I enjoyed being with a girl more than with a guy. When I was with a guy, I didn't enjoy it, it didn't do anything for me, I wasn't excited, I wasn't anything at all. Um, when I was with a girl, even though I was 13, I really, really liked it, and it was kind of comforting in a way, because this is how I feel now, at least, with, you know, in my past experiences with dating so, well, okay, I've dated a lot of girls, but I didn't sleep with a lot of girls. Um, I've probably had sex with about eight, maybe nine nine girls in the past since past like 15 years I guess um, a lot of them were not obviously like long-term relationships but for the most part most of them were so I mean I don't know but the good thing that I think about with being with a girl is that they know how they know what they like right so when you're with a woman, it's so much easier because I feel like you have a connection. You know what I mean? Like, you you know what they want because you like the same thing, in a way. I'm not saying that all girls like the same stuff, but you know how to treat a girl because you know how you want to be treated, I guess. I find that when you're with a girl, it's more passionate and more just emotional. You know what I mean? And I'm not saying that like when you have sex with a guy it's not there's not no emotions there because there is um although i've never actually experienced that so i don't really know but um you know i just believe that it's more passionate and it's more just intense with the girl you know you know what they like and it's easier to talk to a girl it's easier to say hey you know I like this I want you to do this you know or I don't want you to do that because you have the same body parts so therefore you can kind of go on each other's words or your you know even just your body language you know so I don't know so um like I said my first experience was with a girl when I was 13 and it was mainly like using fingers and yes there was a little bit of oral in there but not much but and then I would say then when I was 19 yeah 19 almost 8 well actually I was 18 I had my first big experience with the, with the with the girl and full blown sex and um it was amazing it was very intense and it was actually with my first girlfriend that I ended up with and um, I ended up with her for about four years. So it wasn't like a short-term relationship or anything like that. It was really, really a good relationship for the most part until I realized that they were, you know, she was cheating on me towards the end, but whatever. But so I guess um, my question to you is what was your first like experience, experience like sexual experience? Was it good? Was it bad? Um, you know, did you thoroughly enjoy it? Did you hate it? Did you love it? I mean, what? tell me, I want to know, you know, not like in a creepy way, but, and I'm not scared to talk about that, you know, like I said, everything is an experiment in life. Life is an experiment. So I think that, um, you know, you should just kind of go with it. And life is either um, a daring adventure or nothing. And Helen Keller said that, so. Okay, so I want to know, your sexual, your first sexual encounter, did you hate it? Did you love it? Would you do it again? Yeah, all that stuff.
Okay, I love you. I mean it. And I will talk to you guys soon. Peace, love. Woo!